Yo, what's going on guys? Pineapple Swift here with you guys the Seahawks Steam Team Episode 11. And as you can tell from the top three, we obviously got John Randall. And uh, before I get into it though, uh, if you guys would please consider liking and subscribing. We're on the goal of trying to hit 1200. And if you guys would want a John Randall gameplay, let me know. Or maybe a DK Metcalf gameplay. Um, just feel free if you guys want a DK gameplay or, you know, a John Randall gameplay. Let me know. Comment down below. But we're going to be talking about the team. Last episode, we showcased DK Metcalf and Jimmy Graham. Today, I'm going to be showing, uh, showcasing John Randall and Rondé Barber. Now, John Randall might very well be the best defensive tackle in the game. Um, Gilbert Brown might be better, but just because of John Randall's build and all the stats he has to offer. Um, very amazing card. And then, obviously, the 2 AP inside stuff. And he gets Seahawks cam. Uh, he gets defensive rallying inside stuff in the tier 4 slot. And then these are his tier 3 abilities. Nothing really stands out significantly. Maybe strip specialist and inside stuff. Other than that, nothing great. Um, I still have a free AP point though on defense. I'm going to be saving that for Channing Crowder for that 1 AP lurk artist. But we're going to be showcasing this Rondé Barber as well. Who... <laughs> is an 89 overall um, team captain, but Kim boosted uh, on my theme team, Seahawks theme team, he goes up to a 91 overall. Now, obviously, I'm not going to say that this is the best team captain in the game, but he very well might be the highest overall team captain in the game. And <laughs> basically, um, what I mean by that. Uh, by being the highest overall team captain in the game. Um, I think Rondé, or I think Eric Berry and the rest of the team captains can only go up to a 90, while uh, Rondé can go up to a 91, which is one of the highest overalls in the game. Uh, if you look at the stats, I mean, the card is absolutely god tier. The only thing that's holding him back is his height, obviously. But uh, yeah, 90 speed, 90 excel, 90 agility, 85 jumping, 89 play rec. 90 man coverage, and 91 zone. And how am I doing that exactly, you may ask? I have 3 out of 4 for the team captain slots. I have 51 out of 50 Seattle Seahawks chemistry. And my um, strategy items, I have plus 2 man coverage to my corners, and then plus 1 zone coverage to all players is what gives Rondé that 91 overall. So, just wanted to showcase that. Because, um, you know, if you're like, you know, if you like to have those high overall cards or like the highest overall cards, um, Rondé Barber is a very interesting one. Yes, he, by, by no means am I saying he's the best team captain, but if you like to achieve high overalls and you're trying to flex like players on your team like me, you know, then Rondé might be the right guy for you. But honestly, I like Rondé personally. He's really good. Um, I run a Tampa 2 scheme, so he does amazing for me. But yeah, I mean, if you look at my top three, it's pretty menacing. You have 91 Metcalf, 91 Rondé, and then 91 John Randall. Uh, absolutely crazy team. I'm going to be playing around with the chemistries a little bit more just to see what I can come up with. But yeah, this is um, episode 11. But yeah, if you guys want to see a John Randall gameplay or a DK gameplay, let me know. Feel free to drop it in the comment section below. Peace out.